You've made it to Thailand. You have your bags and you're through customs. Now, how do you get to your hotel? Most travelers just assume that they'll take a taxi. It's not a bad idea. If you want to take the chance of seeing traffic for a few hours and paying 300 to 400 baht, for those of us who like to save money and travel faster, we take what is called the Airport Rail Link. I'm my mate Nate, and this video is focused on the different ways you can leave the airport with an emphasis on the Airport Rail Link because it's cheap, it's fast, and it's the best way for you to get to where you want to go here in Thailand. Let's quickly talk about the different ways that you can leave the airport before we talk about the airport railing. The taxi. It's very simple. You come to the first floor, hop in this line right here, get your queue ticket, and get in your taxi. There is an extra 50 baht fine on top of the taxi fare. Keep in mind, that 50 baht is more expensive than the most expensive token on the airport railing. It's your choice. But for me personally, there's only one reason that I would take a taxi over the airport railing. And that is, I need to go the opposite way that the airport railing goes. On the second floor, you can get a limousine, rent a car, or you can take a minivan. For more information on these methods of transportation here at the airport, check us out on thailand69ways.com. But by taking a road vehicle, you always run into the same problem, traffic. And trust me, here in Bangkok, it sucks. Like, a lot. Before we use the airport rail link, we need to get to a station. Here at the airport, that's simple. There are signs everywhere, and I mean everywhere. But, just in case you can't figure it out, here's a phrase that you can use in Thai that'll help you get to the station. You're gonna say, airport link, you Tinai. Airport link, you Tinai, which translates to, where is the airport link? That phrase is not only gonna help you here at the airport, but it can help you in all of your travels. Switch out the word airport link for, let's say, McDonald's. Where's McDonald's? You're gonna say, McDonald's, you Tinai. And if you ask that to a Thai, most of them speak good enough English that they can get you going in the right direction to where you want to go. Once you get to a station, you have two ways that you can pay. The first is by going to the ticket counter, and the second is by using an automated machine. It's simple, and either way you choose, you're gonna get a circular token. Now, with that circular token, you use it to pass through the security check. You just tap it on the scanner, and you hold on to it, because when you leave, that's how you get out of security. It's simple, but make sure you don't lose it. The airport rail link opens at 6 a.m. and closes at midnight every single day, seven days a week. Now, one of my personal favorite and most convenient things about the airport rail link is it connects with other ways to travel throughout Bangkok. You connect with the subway trains, the sky trains, and the canal boats. These three methods of transportation, including the airport rail link, can get you pretty much anywhere you need to go here in Bangkok for cheaper than sitting in a taxi and faster. If you have any questions on anything Thailand, food, transportation, language, money, visas, anything, check us out at thailand 69 ways.com. I'm my mate Nate and until next time enjoy your travels and live life to its fullest. See you later.